Okay. <clears throat> a 72 FX. I got it from the second owner, and he'd owned it for 25 years. He uh, obviously took ridiculously good care of it. It's been repainted and fully restored, but he used all NOS stuff. He even used a real deal 70, 71, 72 wiring harness when he built it. Um, it's got like no time on it. Motor's all correct. He did put this little um, oil pressure gauge, which is nice because this thing makes really good oil pressure and it's always nice to know it's working. Um, everything works mint, start, stop, run, drive. Motor's super quiet, no leaks. Gaskets are all really nice, correct cylinders, correct heads. Um, all the correct finishes. It's really uh, a pretty nice one. So this is, <laughs> he said when he would ride it, which was rare, he used this seat, because these seats crack a lot, see? Basically, if you use them, they crack, they're made of plastic. And then when you go to the show, he put this one on, which is basically a brand new one. It's in brand new condition. And then he has a repo speedo in there. And then he's got a brand new NOS in the box speedo for it that he's never put in with three miles, which they, I believe they did that from the factory. Um, <clears throat> so those are the two only things that are really, I mean, if I didn't need anything, but it would be perfect to put that speedo in. Um, it has the electric start option, which was an option in 72. It's got brand new NOS, correct year, good year tires on the front and the back which are fucking impossible to get. Um, if you look like even like these stickers, see how those little lines in them, these are original stickers. Internal throttle. Just a really sweet, uh, sweet bike. Runs real good. I'm gonna get my hand over here. Finishes, all the chrome's been redone and it's perfect. The rims are correct. Really good one. 